Greetings, gamer girls. I am Salstein, also known as Cold Collection, and tonight, welcome back to more Pokemon Blue. In the last episode, we got we uh, cleared out all the trainers and items in the Silphco, and in this episode, we have more a few more trainers to go. What kept you, Blue? Ha ha ha! I thought you'd turn up if I waited here. I guess Team Rocket slowed you down. Not that I care. I saw you in Saffron, so I decided to see if you got better. You mean you could have stopped Team Rocket yourself this whole time and you didn't? And then again, my team is better than yours, so it doesn't matter. And I totally forgot to. Well, I guess. You know what? Fine. We'll do. A, uh, we'll do. Cat, we'll do Captain Falcon versus Captain Falcon. So, uh, so let's start off. Red's Pidgeot, level 37, normal flying type, with the moves Wing Attack, Sand Attack, Quick Attack, and Whirlwind. Remember, he has a different team depending on what starter you chose, but he always starts with... But he always starts with Pidgeot no matter what. And we have a speed tie, don't we? Alright. Up next, Gyarados, and I don't even remember if anybody, if I taught anybody Thunderbolt. I don't think I did. Uh, we can try to have Poppy Bros use Rock Slide. Red's Gyarados, level 38, with a water flying type with moves Leer, Dragon Rage, Bite, and Hydro Pump. It's that Hydro Pump that worries me, and I did not mean to use Dig there. Why did I... Uh, okay, fine. That was a goof on my part. I'll be damned if Poppy Bros doesn't go down. Oh, critical. Screw you. Can't believe I accidentally used, used Dig there. Let's try Mega Drain. It's not doing very much. Let's try Psychic then. Okay. Uh, up next. Red's Growlithe, level 35, Fire Type, with the moves Roar, Ember, Leer, and Takedown. Um, shouldn't be a problem for Leonardo. Leonardo can pretty much annihilate any Fire Type with his moves. Jeez, what is with me and Critical Hits lately? Up next, I'm actually going to send uh, Orpheus out here for this one. Um... Blue, uh, Red's Alakazam, level 35, Psychic type, with the move Psybeam, Confusion, Disable, and Recover. I just want to see how much Psychic is going to do and just see how good Orpheus' special stat is. And I'm actually hoping he doesn't get a critical. Oh. Well, he's definitely going down here. Oh. Jeez, is this like, is this like Smash Fest 19 or something like that? Um, Captain Falcon. Actually, maybe I should have had a Mazzola use Toxic. Then again, I don't know if it would have outsped Ed Mazzola. And lastly, um, Red, Red Venusaur. I should have said Mazzola. Oh, well. Um, Level 40, Grass Poison Type, with the moves Leech Seed, Vine Whip, Poison Powder, and Razor Leaf. No idea why it has both, both Vine Whip and Razor Leaf, but hey. I guess maybe Vine Whip's more accurate. And there we go. Cat and Felton grew to level 41. 
Oh ho, so you are ready for Boss Rocket. <laughs> well, Blue, I'm moving on up ahead. By checking my Pokedex, I'm starting to see what's strong and how they evolve. I'm going to the Pokemon League to boot out the Elite Four. I'll become, I'm the world's most powerful trainer. Blue, well, good luck to you. Don't sweat it. Smell ya. The Elite Four. Alright. Oh, hi. You're not a rocket. You came to save us? Why, thank you. I want you to have this Pokemon for saving us. We get Lapras. It's Lapras. It's very intelligent. We kept it in our lab, but it will be much better off with you. I think you will be a good trainer for Lapras. It's a good swimmer. It'll give you a lift. Lapras, the transport Pokemon. Lapras is actually a very good Pokemon. It's water and ice type, and even though ice isn't the best type, there are a lot of good ice moves, and it would be good for it to get saved to attack bonus. It's good. It's a good. It's a good defensive mix attacker with a ton of HP, but it's a little bit slow. If you want to use it, I highly recommend it. Team Rocket's boss went to the boardroom. Is our president okay? Let's go see. And during that bio, I went back and healed. And seems we got one more guy to face before we can face the boss. Alright, Cubo. Won't be a problem to get Falcon. I'm gonna see if I can take it. I'm gonna see if I can take on the boss without uh, healing before, without healing after this guy. So you want to see my boss? You bet I do. The car key opened the door. Ah, blue, so we meet again. The president and I are discussing vital business proposition. Keep your nose out of growing up matters or experience a world of pain. We are facing Giovanni for the second time. Okay, Giovanni's need arena now. Level 37, poison type with the moves horn attack, poison safe, focus energy, and fury attack. Of course, we're just gonna have Poppy Bros use dig. Up next. Uh, Giovanni's Kangaskhan, level 35, with moves Comet Punch, Rage, Bite, and Tail Whip. This is gonna use, use Dig to get same type attack bonus. I'm gonna switch to Leonardo for this. Giovanni's Rhyhorn, level 37, ground rock type with the moves Horn Attack, Stomp, and Tail Whip. And lastly, Giovanni's Nido Queen, level 41, with moves. 
Poison Ground Sight would remove Scratch, Tail Whip, Body Slam, and Poison Sting. Alright. Uh, I just use Strength. Leonardo grew to level 41! 41! And we defeated Giovanni. Urgh, I lost again! Blast it all, you ruined our plans for Sil. But Team Rocket will never fall. Blue, never forget that all Pokemon exist is for Team Rocket. I must go, but I'll sure will turn. Sure. Thank you for rescuing all of us. We admire your courage. Thank you for saving the self. I will never forget that you, you saved us in our moment of peril. I have to thank you in some way. Because I am rich, I can give you anything. Here, maybe this will do. Right. Didn't mean to hit that. Here we get the Master Ball. You can't buy that anywhere. It's our secret prototype, Master Ball. It will catch any Pokemon without fail. You should be quiet about using it, though. Yes, the Master Ball is the most powerful Pokeball of them all. That... You can use it on any Pokemon you want, and it will supposedly never fail. So go, so you should use it on a Pokemon that has that has like um the ultimate annoyance to catch. And for some reason, there's a PC up here, so I'm gonna deposit Lapras and my items. I already have an idea on what I want to use the Master Ball on, even though its catch rate isn't particularly low. I just like I just like using it on that Pokemon because um because uh I can't really think of anything else to use it on. I'm gonna get rid of this calcium not cricket calcium. Well well yeah, we are getting rid of the calcium because we're gonna use it later. Are you serious? <sighs> okay, let's see what we can withdraw from this. Hmm. Sell that. Sell these. We can also sell these. Okay. Put this in the PC as well, that carbos. Maybe I should just use the vitamins, but I haven't really calculated, but, but we don't really have our full team yet, obviously, so, so um, I want to wait to calculate that. Let's have Poppy Bros dig us out of here. No idea how he did it. And... Oh right, I forgot. It doesn't take you to the entrance. It takes you to the last Pokemon Center you healed at. Good thing we had Captain Falcon with us. So, there is one other thing we can do in Saffron City before we take on the gym. Which I'll gonna go ahead and do that. All right, let's jump on the bike. Uh, the rocket from the, that is, it was in front of that house is gone too. It was also in, uh, a, gone, the rocket that was in front of the gym is also gone. But I want to check out the second gym that's in uh, that's in Saffron, Fighting Dojo.
So, we have a bunch of trainers in here, and I think this is, should be, um... You know what? We'll get Captain Falcon prepared for the gym, because we're going to use him for the gym. Hoo-ha! You're, you're trespassing in our fighting dojo! So we have a couple, tra we have five trainers in here. The black belt. So, yeah, this place is, um, according to, um, uh, sources in this game, this actually was originally a Pokemon gym, yet, um, it wasn't until the gym next door creamed them. So, I am I can only assume that, actually, wait, no. So I can only assume that it was the gym in Viridian City that became the eight, became the last one. Alright. You know, Prime looks a lot, a lot fuzzier in red and green. I didn't see what he said. The prime fighters across the land train here. I heard you're good. Show me. I'll show ya. Like, I don't know why I'm bouncing on my bed right now. Cat and Velvet grew to level 42. Judge, one point. Our master is a pro fighter. Nothing tough frightens me. I break boulders for training. Yep, and yet you're not doing any actual fighting. Yeah, stub fingers. Hoar, take your shoes off. Okie dokie. Falcon can learn mirror move. I'm not sure though. And we missed. I'm gonna try using wing attack. Wow. I'm uh, just going to remind you that Primeape is the fastest fighting type in the game. I give up. Yeah, you don't really have a choice in the matter, buddy. Wait till you wait till you see our master. I'm a small fry compared to him. Oh ho! <laughs> I am the Karate Master, I am the leader here. You wish to challenge us, expect no mercy. Fwaaaaaa! Alright, the Fighting Master, I'm gonna go over his Pokemon. He's got, he's got Hitmonlee, level 37, fighting type, with the moves Double Kick, Meditate, Rolling Kick, and Mega Kick. Careful of Mega Kick, even though it's 70% accurate, it has 120 power, but it's a normal type move. So it's a lot different than Mega Punch. 
Up next, Hitmonchan. Level 37, Fighting Type, with moves Comet Punch, Agility, Fire Punch, and Mega Punch. Fire Punch doesn't really benefit it very well since it's special to has Abysmal. Cat and Velen grew to level 43! Hua! Are beaten! Indeed I have lost! But I beseech you, do not take our emblem as your trophy. In return, I will give you a prize fighting Pokemon. Choose whichever one you like. Got Hitmonlee. And Hitmonchan. Alright, uh... Let's go over these Pokemon, shall we? Hitmonlee, the kicking fiend. Hitmonlee is the more offensive of the, of the two, with a... With a beastly attack stat uh only problem is it's not very good at standing up to much but if you want to get one i'm not gonna lie it is pretty good so so yeah if you so yeah hit my is pretty good if you want more offense if you want more defense however you can pick hitmonchan the punching demon uh hitmonchan hitmonchan is more defensive but at least in this game i would actually recommend Picking Hitmonlee over Hitmonchan. If you want to Hitmonchan, that use if you want to use Hitmonchan, that's totally fine. But the thing about it is the fact that it's it's known for using its the elemental punches, fire punch, thunder punch, and ice punch. But because of their types, they're kind of the special moves in this game. And as you can see, it's Hitmonchan's special stat is not exactly beastly. It's still good, but just not as at as but just not as good as it could be. For this game, though, I think I'm actually going to take... Hmm... Uh, I think I'll go with Hitmonlee. I will not give a nickname to Hitmonlee. Enemies on every side! Better not get greedy. Okay, guys. I think we're going to end the video off here. Next time on Pokemon Blue, we're going to take on the Saffron Gym and take on Sa Sabrina, the mistress of psychic Pokemon. Be and that wouldn't be, that would, if it was Master, that'd be incorrect. But whatever. I will see you guys next time. And as always, remember to smile. You were the face of Cold Collection and then Nine Gaming. Goodbye.